uh, planetariums were just, I don't want to say just, but we would have four shows a year, one each season. And we'd show the stars of the night sky, and then the voice of the director would guide you through them. And it's like really different. Oh. It's, actually, it's actually, you know, it, it follows along in a, in a legacy, obviously, of the, the planetarium. In the traditional sense was the sky and seeing the positions of planets and stars and so forth. But with the advent of the rebuild of this, really at the advent of the turn of the millennium, we, we had the ability to really full, fully display the science data on the dome continuously in a movie format. When that happened, that really opened the door to visualizing basically the three-dimensional layout of the universe and then the simulations of its behavior. Kids may get the excitement, they'll get big ideas, they may not get every idea. Um, but hopefully we've built the content such that there is some scaffolding there that they can, they can build an understanding over the course of the show.